Moving on, India and Finland are set to work closely on future technologies, including AI and quantum technologies. Both sides are keen to diversify their trade partnership and double trade from the 2 billion euros goods and services trade currently. Finland is also looking to have closer trade partnerships with a series of trusted partners, including India, in light of the Ukraine-Russia war. I caught up with Willy Skinari, Finland's Minister for Development Cooperation and Foreign Trade, and began by asking him about the India-Finland trade partnership. So many good things are happening. Our trade figures going further, our key companies, emerging technologies from Nokia, mm -hmm. 5G, energy sector, we see Finnish companies providing solutions for aviation industry, biofuels for instance, but also the upcoming technologies when it comes to industries, hydrogen for instance. Mm. So I think all in all, um, digitalization, green transition, they actually, they go hand in hand mm -hmm. and they should go even more. And that kind of, kind of comprehensive thinking is very Nordic. The, the reason for your travels to several countries over the last uh, few weeks, you have been in, uh, in Doha recently, you're going to be traveling to Kazakhstan, Uzbekistan. Is this all a part of an effort to widen the trade basket in light of what's happening uh, with the Ukraine-Russia war? Finland has always been an active country at the international level. We always wanted to carry our global responsibility. We wanted to do very active trade. Mm -hmm. And we are a very export-driven economy. Mm -hmm. Very strong country also mm -hmm. with businesses. And of course, geopolitics is different now. Mm -hmm. Having uh, the war, Russia's attack on Ukraine, uh, and it's something that we are looking for new partners. Mm. Even I visited Australia, New Zealand. Um, I really want to, to build up trusted partnership and India as a country, as, as an opportunity, of course. That's why as a government with our national airline, we are very committed also to promote these people to people connections. Mm. Because our country is complete each other. So if you look at India, Finland, mm. demographics, mm. but also so much similarities. Mm. Talented people, good education system, mm. um, English language. Mm. So there's so much in common. Mm. And that's why I'm very happy to see that more and more startup companies, SME, SME companies from Finland and coming to India, mm. but also investments and people coming to Finland mm. to, to work and to invest. We're nearing 12 months. This war is completing one year very soon. Is it likely to end anytime soon? Uh, in your assessment, how long is Europe preparing for this war to continue? Well, yes, it's been a year roughly and uh, Finland has supported Ukraine from the beginning, actually from 2014. And we are com com committed to continue that support. Mm. Hopefully, there is a solution. But right now, it's very difficult to see the timeline or the solution, unfortunately. I visited Kiev, and it's a very unfortunate situation, mm -hmm. the war, what Russia started.